So today I've got a quick one for you. I take this pufferfish model and I make it into a flow nozzle. This project actually stems from a request on reeftoreef.com. I thought it was a kind of unique project, so I wanted to see how fast I could do it and ultimately help out the person who requested that I make this. So if you like this model in this video, please be sure to like and subscribe and stay to the end so you can figure out where to download this model for yourself. Welcome back to IC Live. My name is Mark. So today I've got a quick one for you. I got a request on reeftoreef.com to create a flow nozzle out of this pufferfish model. The request is from Cobast out of Australia. And the request reads, OC Ponds Poacher, you have an amazing ability. I'm standing up and I'm telling you I am Warhol. I am the number one most impactful artist of our generation. I am Shakespeare in the flesh. Walt Disney, Nike, Google. Now who's gonna be the Medici family and stand up and let me create more? I have a new 3D printer at home, but I'm anxiously waiting to get out of the hospital to assemble it. Obviously as a newbie, I can't design the fish I want. Would you be able to modify slash design this puffer fish so it is a water spout for my grandson? So I thought this was a pretty unique request and I was gonna actually tackle it. It doesn't seem to me like this is gonna be very hard at all, but I wanted to make sure I clarified what this person is looking for so I don't waste any time. And here's what they're looking for. It is basically screwing this threaded barbed attachment into the bottom of the belly of the puffer fish and then having the water flow out the top. This seems like it's gonna be extremely easy because all I'm gonna do is gonna create the internal structure with the threads and the path of the water. And then I'm just gonna subtract that from the puffer fish with a bullion difference operation. So here is the modeling. So here is the finished model. As I mentioned earlier, all I did was subtract out these threads and this pathway for the water to go ahead and flow out the fish's mouth. And because I was able to download this puffer fish off free 3d.com, I didn't have to waste any time modeling it. And I think this person is gonna be happy. So now I take this model and I post up some pictures back on reef to reef.com and I make it available on Thingiverse. So if you'd like to download it, go ahead and click the link in the description. And thank you so much for watching. And like always, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you live in the next video.